Thank you, Simone. Are there any veterans out in the audience? Please stand up. Please stand up so we can recognize you for your service. Thank you. We live in a great country. It's a country of marvelous technological advances, advanced medicine, but yet it's also a country of paradox. It's a country that values physical exterior, what I call facade beauty over sometimes the inner workings of a human being. It's a country where you can get Botox casually and conveniently, but yet a vet, a police officer, a first responder cannot get basic mental health services. As a veteran, I am here, hopefully, with your support and with your encouragement, do something about it. I'm, I'm, I'm not a politician. I'm simply someone who has endeavored because I have struggled with what is now known as PTSD since 1991 when I left active service. I have to have to fight two different types of stigma, not only for my peers. As you know, as a Marine, you know that old saying, the few, the proud. We carry that to our graves. And I've also had to fight the other stigma, which is my culture. As an Asian, we're supposed to be rigid and disciplined. But I tell you, this disease knows no borders, no boundaries. So we're here together with your help. I want to bring a fight to this disease by first eradicating it from its core, from stigma. We are the proudest nation on the planet. We need to come out of the dark ages in terms of stigma, fear of ridicule, ostracism, being castigated. At the end of the day, we are just here because we're united by one purpose, which is to bring an end to the stigma that prevents the accurate treatment of our heroes, first responders, and people that have signed a blank check to our government to serve, to honor, to protect. It's time for us to do the same.